In August of 2000, this was our first look at the Game Boy Advance. This prototype would be used by early developers in order to have games ready for launch. Let's take a little closer look, shall we? This is booting no game. Notice anything different? As you can see, it does the same thing with the Game Boy or Game Boy Color cartridge, so this does not boot those types of games. But I did notice the spot for another switch to be installed, uh, so I'm assuming with the proper switch installed you probably could boot those games. There are a couple of games with graphical glitches, it just seems to be some of the newer ones, uh, like in Donkey Kong Country 3 here. Super Mario Bros. 3 or Super Mario Advance 4 or whatever the fuck it is. Anyway, it seems to fare worse, which ends up looking like that. It seems to be the minority though, since out of all these games I tested, the ones on the left worked fine and the ones on the right had glitches. I also wanted to mention you can plug in a Super Nintendo controller into one of these things. I don't have one of these to show you, but uh, this is what it looks like anyway. And I guess that's all there is really to say about this thing. I don't have it anymore, I sent it back, but I did want to say thanks to Sean for giving me the opportunity to fix this for him. But I'll just leave you here with a little bit of gameplay to close things off. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.